All right, so I just got a new water housing from Liquid Eye. It's the C2060, built for the Sony A7 Mark III camera. And also, I got a gear sleeve uh, for my zoom lens. Um, so, I'm going to go through um, how to attach this. Quite simple. Uh, the new gear sleeves uh, don't have the the hex bolt system that the that the older rings had. So um, it's very easy to put on. Uh, you find the top center of your lens and make sure that your zoom is all the way to the right. Your gear sleeve, the, the gears are to the back end of the, the bayonet and you'll see that there's a groove cut here on the top of your gear sleeve. That lines up with the center uh, of the top of your lens and you just slide it on from the back, lining it up. Uh, it may depend on which lens, uh, how far this bottom sits from uh, the bayonet. Uh, so you just maybe have to play with that a little. Um, once it's lined up, you can attach it to your camera. Uh, quite easy, of course. You just want to blow it out real quick. It's nice and clean and attach your lens just like that. All right, that's it, simple. Um, when you load your camera into the housing, uh, what, I, what I do is I set it to its, it's the up position. And on my water housing, I set my my zoom control um, in a to a downward position. Um, opposite, I don't know. You might we want to do the opposite. I don't know, but this is what works for me because we have this this line just makes it that much easier. So that's the top position. This is down position. Now let's load this. Just a couple things before loading your camera is to, if you have um, a filter, lens filter, you want to remove your lens filter from your, from your lens and of course you're going to remove your lens cap, uh, you're going to remove your uh, eye cup from the back, um, you're going to want to make sure that you have uh, your uh, SD card is loaded or whatever kind of card you're using. Uh, make sure you have a fully charged battery and you want to turn your camera into the on position if your housing has the on off uh, uh, control which this does. So I want to put this in the on position and uh, also uh, lightly attach uh, lens port. Okay, so now before you attach your, your lens port, you want to check your blue uh, O-ring. You want to make sure that it's, it's clean and um, free from impurity sand or hair or uh, something like that. And sit it into the groove that's inside of this this hole. Um, place your port on top. Um, I usually um, give it a back spin, make sure it's engaged, and then uh, spin it on, not too tight. Flip it over, and we'll remove the back plate uh, quickly. This is an on position, it's down, it's on, and we're going to load this on, okay, 
and you can attach your your cable just like so and it's in the ground position and just slide it right in boom just like that tuck your wires um, to the side and then we're gonna check our back o-ring all right the back o-ring is the only o-ring that you want to apply this grease to uh, it's a silicone grease um, and just a dab and go around um, spread it evenly and very thinly you don't need a lot of this uh, this this bag goes a long long way so um, that's it just go around the edges so it has like a wet look to it but you don't want any build up on that all right and then then we're going to tighten this up real quick uh, just give it a couple turns as you go around the housing. Um, this takes, I don't know, about a minute or so, maybe. Um, some of the other uh, different housings have different um, ways to close the, the, the uh, control plate, or sometimes it's a front plate. Um, butterfly, like a wing wing nut and uh, these hex um, some others have like a like a clasp on the side um, but this system uh, although it takes about a minute or so to, to get it on um, there's a bit more um, I feel that it's a, a safety issue when you're in the water. Um, not only for your um, yourself, but for your camera and your, your lens, your gear. Um, but it doesn't take that long to get it on there. Right? And then you have a nice uh, flat seal. You can see the seal that goes around so you know that uh, no water is getting inside this housing. And then um, we'll look at uh, our zoom. There you go. Let me see, we're all ready to zoom in on you. Right? And you're ready uh, to shoot. That's it. Uh, quite simple. Uh, before you get in the water, make sure that you give this. Uh, a good a good uh, twist so it's nice and and uh, tight on there yep that's it all right thanks for watching this video um, uh, and uh, we'll be doing um, uh, some more things in the future uh, that's it take care have a good day and happy shooting